Hi everybody, it's Carrie. Hello, welcome to my channel if you are new here. Welcome back if you've been here before. Today guys, well first of all guys, I have a quick disclaimer. If you hear the TV in the background, um, lately I have been too tired to film at night and I just pass out. So I have to film in the daytime while Daddy's watching TV. I apologize for that, so please excuse that. Today guys, this video is not a happy one. I'm sorry guys, I'm making so many like sad for me videos lately. If you guys have not watched any of my three videos um, where I discuss my father's condition, um, you might want to check those out before you see this because this video is not going to make sense really. I mean, I'm going to break it down a little bit in case you haven't seen this video to explain this one to you. Guys, my friends are actually turning on me, calling me names, and making fun of me because my father is sick. If you guys do not know, my dad has an infection in his bladder area. And the doctors thought he had prostate cancer. Guys, I'm talking lower too because I don't want daddy is very upset about this. And guys, my friends, so called friends, have been making remarks for years that my dad is going to die soon. That I need to get on SSI, I need to get on food stamps, as I told you guys. About my friend's dad. Put my friends, one of my, two of my so called friends, actually their parents, which is just ganging up on me. Telling me off, as you guys seen the video probably by now, where it's not uploaded right now, but we upload it as a filming. But we upload it by the time you see this. We're my friend's dad is picking on me. My friends tell me things like, Your father's gonna die soon. What are you gonna do? You spent your whole life almost 30 years, do the 30 years. First, I'm not even 30 yet. You spent 30 years taking care of a sick parent. Blah, blah, blah. Where are you going to be when your dad dies? Okay, guys. That is so rude. Like, my dad is sick. I you think I don't think he's going to die one day? I know he's going to die one day. Sorry, guys. I just... I did my shower and went to sleep because I was exhausted yesterday. Last night. But anyway, guys. No, this morning. I got shower at like 5 o'clock in the morning. I started back to the story. I'm sure that I'm not in the best light. Um... So now I'm being bullied. And my other friend started fighting with me, bragging about all of her designer things that she has, how much more of a girl basically she is than me. And I was like, okay, well, it's okay. Because you guys, now I do have some, now I showed you guys my perfumes. I get perfumes at, like, for samples and stuff. I mean, she's an also, I don't care. My dad bought me she's number five for the first time when I was like four, so I don't care. And then it was, that one mentioned, guys, there was some of that was also left over for my grandma, who was a big Chanel number no. 5 fan. So my dad gave it to me. My friend said, you never had anything designer. No, you never did. You have nothing good. And I have all these designers, and I'm so much better than you, and everything I have is more expensive than you. And I snapped, guys. I said to her, you know what? Guys, actually, I do have a couple of designer purses that I bought secondhand, and one I saved up for months for. She said, that's too much money to spend $60 on a purse. But yet, she keeps bringing up that I have nothing and I'm in the gutter. Guys, I take care of my father, and on my free time, I call my uncle, who is also almost 90. So, I try to make sure that two ugly men are taken care of. And yes, I do call my cousin's house if I don't hear from my uncle. Your best bet. I will call her and be like, hey, Patty, where's Uncle Joe? Dead serious. Like, I don't, I don't mess with that. They're two elderly guys, and I just don't mess with that. So now, guys, my friend is writing me saying how she hates me. She wishes I would die. Basically telling me she wish I would get cancer. Now, guys, if you guys read some other videos, there's a chance that my father might have prostate cancer. They said that it's, they think it's a bladder infection. It's on all kinds of antibiotics. Now, guys, as somebody who for the last two months, this is really heartbreaking, has watched her father choke down big white pills and antibiotics and all kinds of meds for the last two months while doctors are struggling to figure out what in the heck he has. Do you think it is okay, guys, to write me? And I admit, guys, I said to my friend that, yeah, I know about Coral. I've talked about him plenty of times. Coral, Carl, Corey, whichever name. I would say one of them three is his real name, but Coral is not it. 
Um, and if you watch some other videos, you know his real name. I give it away. And I said, over, well, at least, you know, he'll probably, I didn't want to say this on camera because I don't get monetized. Um, we're going to date me and probably kiss and hug me and, and lick places. I'm not going to say here. Her comment back, guys, I, get, I kid you not, was, well, at least I might have breast cancer. I'm like, what? In this fight, she told me that if I don't become with a friend, I don't tell you, I had a friend who tried to set me up that me raped a few years ago. I'm sorry, guys. I never told you guys this. Or I was insinuating she was setting me up that me raped. She wanted me to go behind the dumpster and do things with her friends. I was, I'm not comfortable with doing, guys. I, I just, I wasn't comfortable with it. And she said, if I don't make up with that girl, then I'm a piece of crap. And I told her what this brat has done to me. And I actually was thinking about pressing charges on this girl. Another girl on a group of friends calls me a hoe and a bum and other derogatory names. And wrote me one day out of the blue and said to me, You're a coral. I'm not going to say his real name on here, but if you guys have heard any of my posts. Guys, I did a video a while back on my dresses. A while back before I got my good phone. And I did a video on my prom, horror stories, where I say Coral's real name clear as day. I say it. Well, actually, you guys knew. I don't say his last name correctly. Um, it's pronounced totally different, and there's a few letters added that I didn't know there. So her mother called me a Coral. Pop, pop, pop. I don't even want to say it. I don't want to risk him saying his name on here because he might watch this. <clears throat> a loving hoe. And then my father, then my friend's mother got on the phone time and told me that my father would be better off if I did the merciful thing and ended my life. And that all I am to my elderly father is a burden because I have seizures. What? Who thought says that? And I was like, what? Now, guys, I do want to stress, one of my friends, my school's mother, was a saint. She's, I say she's a sweetheart. She's warm. I call, she's the one I called crying when we found out that daddy might have cancer. And she was kind and loving. And she said the so sweetest things. And everybody else turned on me. So all of my friends are making jokes and bullying me about my dad being sick. Guys, and nothing I'm telling you in this video. I don't want to make this video 10 minutes long because I don't even want a chance to get monetized. I'm not making this video for monetational reasons. If I have any more extra videos out this week, guys, next couple weeks, it's because I overfilmed and so much crap is going on. Though my friend told me, back to my friend told me she might have cancer in a joking way. She told me she was sorry, but guys, even my dad said, you don't, you don't joke about that. I don't know if I put my hair. I just, I just can't believe someone said this to me. So guys, I have another video to film before a couple more videos go up. But if you guys like my normal content, I'm sorry I'm venting on you guys. I vent on you guys because I have nobody else to vent to. A few of my cousins are saying nice things like, I'm a good daughter and just like always food things. Because I watch my dad take his medicine because I don't trust him to take his medicine. Because he'll lie and say, he'll lie and say I took my medicine. And his condition is not getting any better because he didn't take no medicine. So... Remember until my next uploaded video, guys. Until my happy videos, guys. I have a lot of dolls videos and content coming out and stuff. I just haven't gotten around to watching some of the dolls. But until my next uploaded video, remember, Carrie Ann loves you all so much. Next little video. Remember, comment, like, share, subscribe. Hit that bell. Do you want to be notified all the time? Because my content is all over the place. But this is an adult video. But until my next uploaded video, it was all. Goodbye, guys.